Charges have been filed against Hines County Supervisor David Archie after he was escorted out of a meeting in handcuffs this morning. 12 News' Leah Williams was in the room during the chaotic meeting. It was an intense Hines County Board of Supervisors meeting. Supervisors started discussing the budget and it escalated from there. District 2 Supervisor David Archie says he didn't have enough time to read over the budget before voting, then went on to repeatedly call Supervisors Vern Gavin and Bobby McGowan two dummies. District 3 Supervisor Credel Calhoun tried to continue the board meeting, but Supervisor Archie continued to yell, saying he was just exercising free speech. This comes just one day after Archie was voted out as vice president, but he says he still holds that position. As the vice president of this board, by the way, he don't give me any briefings. Perhaps I may have to step in tomorrow as president of the board. This supervisor have had nothing but chaos since he's been the president of this board. Archie was handcuffed and escorted out, but interim sheriff Marshawn Chrysler decided not to book him. He will be charged with five misdemeanors, disorderly conduct, disturbing the peace, preventing the people's business from being conducted, destruction of county public property, and resisting arrest. It's not personal. The law, the law doesn't have a personal aspect to it. What the law does say is, is that no person is above the law. If any citizen goes in there and do that same thing, guess what, they're gonna be, they're gonna be arrested. I did not break any laws. Um, he instructed the sheriff to place me under arrest because I said two dummies. They want to say that I resist. I didn't resist. I was bracing myself so I don't get hurt. Archie called the arrest a setup to try to silence him, but Supervisor Calhoun says he just wants order in the meetings. I don't have any problem. All they have to do is come here and be in order. That's, that's his job. Take care of people's business. That's all you need to do. And he's out here acting like a thug off the street. Supervisor Calhoun says he'll recommend District 4 Supervisor Vern Gavin to replace Archie as vice president. No word yet on when the board would vote on that. In Jackson, Leah Williams, 12 News.